All right, all right. I think we are live. And is there sound? Yes, there seems to be sound. Okay. Hello, everyone. I'm gonna move this here. I hope it sounds good. I hope the game sounds good. Oh, let me know if you see any problem with the sounds. Um, hello, everyone, and welcome to... Oh, it's been a while. It's actually been a while since I streamed anything, basically. Um, I have some... Interesting, sad news just on the fly. The entire campaign of uh, Chaos Gate was uh, sadly corrupted by an update or something, which means we literally lost all our progress. Uh, the campaign was close to victory, which is the saddest part of it. If we ever retake that game, it's probably gonna be with some sort of special challenge, since at that point we were just going through the motions. Um, other than that, uh, plan B, I guess I'll put it on hold until the game de develops a little bit further, since uh, we were very close to reaching uh, the current end of uh, available content. Uh, and then on the case of Master of Magic, I don't think I'll continue that campaign anytime soon, as the start was pretty pretty weak, and with the difficulties as such extreme, um, we were likely probably going to lose. Maybe we'll take it up later if we feel like it, but I've been going back and forth because there are some games that we can always always return to suffer a little bit and then enjoy the victories together and that is Battle Brothers. Uh, Battle Brothers is at this point an evergreen of uh, mercenary band tactical combat games. Uh, some others have tried to be inspired in the style. Um, War Tales comes to mind uh, but the simplicity of Battle Brothers together with the amount of systems that it offers was always really a great strong point of the series, uh, of, of the entry, right? Like at this point, this, the game, plus it's four DLCs, five DLCs, I don't know, whatever number is available down here. Um, lastly, because I've played this game so much, which I really, really like, uh, I've decided that maybe, maybe we need to add a little bit of spice, a few mods into uh, the mix. Of all the mods that I have, uh, which are numerous, only two of them modify gameplay in any significant way. The first one is that I have decided to remove the hit cap and dodge cap of 5% and 95% respectively, because I absolutely hated having an otherwise perfect shot be ruined by something like a 1 in 20 that can just happen. Uh, it may be fun for some people, but when I make a plan based on statistics, I want the statistics to be real and not your entire game always will depend on this 5% chance to ruin your life completely. Uh, so it's a, it's a small change, but it really does a lot for my mental sanity. And I appreciate that because, you know, <laughs> losing sanity is a slow and insidious killer. And the other one, which I actually never got to see in action is actually a town builder or a stronghold builder if you will but to get there you need to go through so many hoops buy upgrades uh, have retinue and basically survive for a long long time that I actually never got to see the content of that mod so for me it might as well not exist yet but who knows maybe this maybe this is the campaign where we get to it. So, I am going to pick my favorite starting um, composition. I know that all of the others offer fun in different kinds of way, but since I'm not really that good at that game, at this game, um, I've decided to keep something consistent so that I could practice at least every time I move forward. In the case of the trading caravan, you start with only two mercenaries. Um, you will get better prices for buying and selling everywhere, but you start with no renown and you gain renown at a slower rate. Of all the penalties, I think this is the one I care about the least. Uh, getting renown is just a matter of surviving longer and longer. And while there is a point where renown helps a lot, which is the moment where you can start taking um, royal contracts, if you will, uh, it's not really that much of a difference if I never make it to that point. So I'm gonna give it another shot, but this time we will go with Bucky Town. 
And we will see, maybe it works out, maybe we don't reach the point, but it certainly will bring us some fun. Uh, now, the game offers an Iron Man mode, and I will take it as such. Um, when playing alone, one may be tempted to, I don't know, Alt F4 out of certain bad situations. I'm gonna give it a best shot to not doing any of those. Uh, I'm gonna try, together with chat if you help me, to notice when it's time to cut my losses, when it's time to run, when an engagement should not be happening. Um, but there may be times where something goes uh, oddly wrong because I'm using mods. So in those cases, if something would have been obvious that I would not have done, um, we may discuss if uh, I am allowed the grace of uh, Alt F4ing out of the game. In any case, I like this banner. Um, it symbolizes how much I am enjoying the Southern States right now. So this is how we're going to start. Always we go EEL, Iron Man, and I do like not using a known seed and not having an explored map. It just adds a little bit to the mystery of what I will find. I may roll a completely garbage world, I guess that would suck, but here we are. Time to go. Now the trailer start is quite specific on the things it can do, in that you begin with I'm gonna say a bit of potential gold because your caravan there we go starts with a lot of tradable items right like this is around 2k in value if you can cash it all in and that's quite significant now let's look at oh my god okay well i was gonna say let's look at our two units um in trailer caravan start you always get the stars in these positions so that's not a surprise, but what is a surprise is the dexterous melee skill. Now we do start with insecure, which means this person will never be of confident morale. But actually, there is an event that can cure insecurity. So we're gonna try to go for the requirements of that event. Maybe we get lucky and if we make this unit survive long enough, we'll be able to reap the benefit. Still 61 attack, yeah, is actually absolutely insane for uh, what a lowborn this character is. Okay, so we're not gonna be able to cash in our uh, items just yet, even though prices are a little bit higher because of the raided caravan, this makes it so that it's way lower in total. We're gonna check if there's anything interesting, day tellers. Uh, they are pretty cheap. That's quite the positive thing. And we're gonna check if any of these is a non-fighting. Nope. And nope. Yeah, shame. We cannot fight right now. Uh, I think we can come back to this town, especially because there's a Fletcher, which means we may find super good ranged. And then we are offered a very, very quick sale, which I'm gonna take. And then somewhere else. Sadly, none of the southern states seem to be uh, next to the water. But I guess we will live through it. Ah, this I like to see. It's a medium city uh, and it is currently being raided, which means we're probably gonna be able to sell off most of our goods. So you go. Yeah, see the difference? It's already 150 compared to before. All of you go. I don't want to buy anything because the prices are a bit too high right now. But we can find people. Look at that oath taker. That's expensive. Oof, what do we have here that is usable? Another day teller, maybe. A gambler. I don't think gambler. This is one of the mods, for example. I don't need to go to the website to check um, the stats of each background. So it's all information that is publicly known. But this way, I don't need to go and check it. Okay, so what's the problem of a gambler? It, its stats are all over the place, right? Like it basically could be a gem or it could be garbage. I guess we're gonna roll for one of them. Uh, because we need to start buying some padding. Uh, the units may be good, may be bad, but in general, we need things to die that are not our main guys. That is the most important part of it. 
Um, buying this militia would get us a really good weapon, so I'm a bit tempted on that. But let's go with our basic starters here, and we will see how our roster looks like. So these were all special guys. No, that's incorrect. Like this. The gambler ended up rolling absolute insanity. Oh my god, look at this person. Did he roll max morale as well? Yeah. And swift, just because. Okay, so... You are going to be a backliner. Um, I think we can easily fit a scythe on him. Maybe with some initiative and we go... You know what, let's make his build. Um, we go like this, like this. I don't know if we want to swap. Certainly want this and this. Actually, I don't know about this yet. Let us see. What am I at? Five. Six more. One. It would be cool to get an overwhelmed character. Um, I guess we're gonna go on Killing Frenzy. Does this make sense? Overwhelm and a slow attacking... Just one attack, right? Could go daggers, then it's triple attacks, but then he's in danger. But that does sound quite fun. Also, this attack is no matter whether it hits or not, right? Hit or miss. Yeah. yeah that's pretty good. So we could go for that. The health is a little bit low though, so maybe we don't do it. I... It's really a shame because the initiative is really high. Okay, you know what? In any case, he is a special boyo. Need to get him some cool stuff. Who are you? You are a perfect, unimportant character. You're even gonna eat. You want initiative, but actually you just have health. So, another diable character. Finally, oh, another dextrous. Be crazy. And you know what? I think for now, we may have to move around a little. And uh, we certainly have to take easy fights. We cannot risk. So, uh, these people are also raided, right? So I shouldn't take just whatever. Pitchfork. I kind of hate that we're having to pay the extra 25. Extra 20, okay. Maybe we try to clear the raid. Could be this one. Just a caravan. And then just kill normal people. Okay. I feel like we may have to visit one more town before we can begin fighting. So, okay, that's more trapped in the corner than the other one. Ah, now sailing away got really expensive. Count on that. I'm gonna pay that and might as well pay this. Can these people actually be good? I mean, it's, it's five more attack base. The health is not even higher. The morale is pretty bad. The defense is okay. And he has an acceptable helmet, but the weapon. Like, the weapon would be the only important thing out of all. I don't think that's worth buying like that. I think we're gonna go exploring a little bit. So let's go. Sadly, I cannot take those missions yet. We only have six units and none of them have and weapons, except my starters. Uh, maybe I should have taken the path south. south. So, let's see, what's in here? Fine board. Okay, they have no events, that's different. Can even buy some tools, which we're probably gonna need soon. And I see two of these and one of these. 40 to 60, 30 to 50. I mean, if I'm gonna buy this, might as well buy this. The armor, though, is better damage attack. 
broken. I wish this one was broken. So I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna take this for the damage. And look at this random military cleaver. 1000 money. Okay, so we're gonna give you. People are really out of absolute nowhere. That, you're gonna get this. Now at least we have weapons. Let's see if anyone else wants to join us. So we have a Houndmaster. And I guess I know a Dayteller, but... I mean, he comes with a weapon. There's that. Who are you, a Squire? Kinda interested in Egil, only because of his armor. Yeah, I don't feel like any of this will really make it. And let's get out of there. Maybe we buy some food though. Yeah. And let's get back down here. See what happens after one night. Okay, so nothing has changed there. Let's try to wait a little bit. Morning. Go. Oh. We're gonna check people we can recruit. There's one more day teller we could hire. I like the one with the dagger a bit more. Though they basically could look be exactly the same. But before we hire... The cure... Or chase. We're gonna chase people. And uh, we're gonna hire you and probably even the other as well. Yeah, you do nothing special. Nothing special. Either. I mean, you're tough. And could end up with some decent melee defense. But yeah, for now, this is what we have. Let's see what luck we can bring us up. I need to be very careful about those two in the center and the front. But other than that, like maybe we can have a good fight. Opa. Yeah, let's make friends. That was not the track I was supposed to chase, damn it. Southwest. Oh wait, do it. That's a that's a location. Oh, I misread the quest entirely. I think the the thief one was over here, and I just misunderstood. All right. And we do not know what is in here. Should I attack in the night? I mean, we certainly don't have any ranged unit, so yeah, let's do that. Fuck. Night it is. Very good. Okay. I noticed that one of the mods is interfering, so I may have to... Okay, at least the UI is back. But I may have to examine which one it is and remove it, of course. We cannot work like that. So, what is going on here? Thug, thug. Would be great to get this armor. This armor. Maybe those. But the frontliners can just die. Okay. What is the most dangerous weapon here? This is dangerous. This is dangerous. And... So, we're gonna go here. 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 I don't love this guy moving over here, because he will get surrounded, but I think we will be fine. Okay, uh, we move on attack. Where are my health bars? We will move... 
know what? I think for adjacency bonus is a good idea. Here. See if we can get a free stun. Very good. Very lucky. And honestly, I think I want to move one back so that this guy doesn't get a free attack. Um, but you get a swing over here. 50 or 65. Well, this guy is stunned. I should have gone for this guy, I think. And one, two, and put you here. Maybe even. Sadly, this guy has been obstructed from attacking. So we can only move here and pass. Because you are too slow. And that's panic. That is very good panic. That is a lot of panic, actually. Okay, so what are we gonna do? I think I need to wait. Because I need to see who of these will be able to move. And I also want to waste the movement of these people. All these three. Yeah, well, well played. Okay, so you have a dagger. You try to carve this guy out. I'm gonna move like this? No. I'm just gonna... Okay, that guy didn't move. So how about I try to stab him like this? Very nice. Uh, you also have a dagger, so you wait as well. You get over here and stun. Or not. Um, we need to kill this guy, so you are gonna wait. Who wants to act? That's disgusting. I'm thinking of avoiding him altogether. I'm gonna wait here. Um, so we want to kill, kill, carve, kill. <laughs> I mean, that was good armor though, but what can I do? The armor is still alive, that's good. Let's move over here, begin carving. Nice. Nice. One carve complete. Maybe we can try to go for this one as well. We get to scare him a little. That person has a turned on as well. So get over here. Move over here, stab, move, punch, miss. Uh, well, the armor is done for, so yeah, good kill. Wait, stab, stab, miss, good, done, great. Now, can we catch up with this guy? I think Magnus may be able to. So get over here, kill. then get over here, that armor that I care about, I mean, might as well get armor out of it, right, there's no law against us getting armor. Um, let's round you better. Let's person here, let's hopefully get a hit, or not. But we will be able to try next turn. You move here. You can actually not move. So, stab. Can move over there. Wait. Good carve. Nice. Carve. Nice. Try to catch him. Hmm. Let's go this way. You go here. Yes, sadly. Okay. So one of the cool things one of my add-on offers is the ability to say, you know what? Skip with that guy from now on. Not like any of these will reach combat. 
So let me just focus on the two that can still. I would like to get over here. And yep. Yep. Miss. I guess last chance before the map ends. Oh, he got he got scared of the previous direction and started going somewhere new. That may be his doom. Very good. Very good stun. And then it will be over. We got the last kill too. Nice. Okay, so we got no armors. Yay. Um, but we took zero damage, right? That was pretty impressive, I would say. I guess the first panic was just really good. It was a very good hit. Um, the hatchet is okay. Okay, uh, this is another mod. Um, it tells you basically if the worth of a weapon is worth repairing percentages for in order to sell at maximum price. Compared to a base price of tools, I think of like 200, 220. Um, to basically decide whether it's better to repair a weapon or not to. In this case, they're all tier 1, so obviously better not to repair. But we got some shields. And uh, I think that's good news for some of our people. Did we get any levels? No. But you want change. This is now officially yours. Yeah. We want you with a stun, uh, with a shield as well. Okay, of my father, who has the most... That was the answer. I guess we can do it like this. And uh, yeah, he can stay with a dagger for a bit longer. Okay. I guess as far as first fights go, that was pretty clean. I will take it. Oh, another mod. How about times four speed? Whee! Isn't that great? So we got that done. That means prices are now back to normal. That's a lie. The other thing still, of course, counts. I forgot about that. Are we out of tools? No, 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 we're not. Okay. So we have food, we, we have everything. Like this. Anyone want to join us? A grave digger and a peddler. The peddler has nothing good, right? Like maybe the defense can be good. But honestly... Anything else? No, not really. Yeah, it's really just the defense stats that could be good. What about you? This person looks very default. Not even the morale is high enough to justify. The health is mildly higher. Yeah, I'm gonna probably skip on both. Do I care about their backgrounds? I mean, having more units is always good anyway, right? I feel like maybe I should get this. It's father, it's gonna die more gleefully. Well, let's go with that. So, you are as terrible as we imagined. Hilariously though, you have stars in two good places, even though it's just one. But you have brittle bones. You are as useless as we imagined. Okay, and what weapon are you gonna use? Then you will get your own dagger. Well, that's a pretty bad unit, but I guess we'll be fine if it dies. And we got no levels on the first battle. That was a crazy positive first battle, though. Let's see what we can do for battle number two. Okay, it's Nachos. The question is how many? Eight Nachos. That is... That is a number of Nachos. That is not a joke. Move one back and deal with things like that. Um, actually, I'm gonna leave these two available for hitting. 
they cannot be hit by a movement of three, of course. Um, but maybe without moving, we'll be able to reach the enemy and attack on the first turn. That means you move here. So one, two. This is my limit zone. So you go there, you stop there, you go here, there. Kill that person, make a bit of boom. I'm afraid it's gonna attract everyone, so get back here. You will always be able to jump into the front lines, that's not a problem. Um, you can stay up there. Okay, Nachos, come to me. See, the bait worked. They decided to take it. Um, should I wait with everyone? Yes, I should. I guess we can manually... Wait, no, no, never mind. Another... Uh, lethal thing from the mod is the ability to mass weight, which is great. Okay, so the concave could become a problem, but maybe what we need is to make room for a shielded person to get in there. So let's get here and start stabbing things. Um, you should stab actually this. Very good. Very good. Then the shielded person can go there, and my swordsman true can go in here. Uh, that's it for you. Uh, let's repeat the same experiment over here. Very nice. Uh, do we dare concave again? Yes. Very nice. Please help. Very bad. And this is just a stick, probably not gonna kill. Exactly. Pretty bad news for Ralph. Isn't Ralph one of our important people? Did I already ruin things? Maybe I did. Okay. Well, actually, Al Adelbert is also pretty important, so... This is correct. Then I kinda need to kill this guy. Very importantly. What does Gash do? The same damage, but has uh, more chance of wounding. Take it. Honestly, one health remaining. That is just... Whatever. Nothing we can do. But hey, we cut his ear, and I think that's initiative, so... Maybe we get to kill it before it kills us. Okay. Okay, lucky. Lucky. And not dead yet. Not dead. Hey, no deaths is good. Uh, did this one act? Yes. So everyone is done attacking me. Okay. Then we can go here and begin stabbing. Good. We can continue stabbing here. Very nice. Move forward. Pass. Um, I want to remove this. Move more danger. And then go here. Very good. We follow up with this guy. Damn it. Should I move forward? No, that's really dangerous. But I can wait. So let's get you. Okay, fleeing is already better than anything else. Uh, then we wait. What are you gonna do? Shield wall and pray? Looks like shield wall and pray. I guess you could try to stun this. And... So my options are to move here just to be closer or to have an attack. I'm gonna go with the attack. Well, at least we got, we put fear into his heart. So that's nice. What will you do? Punch? Stun? 
Wow. 75% killing us again. Okay. Go for this. Nice. Again, please. Very good. Very good. And we are not gonna move forward because this guy may kill him. Then this guy can go here and one shot us in the head. So, us, us. This one is breaking. Happy. Us. Do you live? That's the only question. Ah, maybe we get to help you live. Maybe not. Ah, but you live anyway. Everybody gets to live for today. So, stab, stab. Maybe I should have stabbed with this guy for the kill, for the experience, you know. Get here, stab. Get here, stab. Hey, <laughs> this is pretty fun. Kill. Should I move? Well, we tried to break him, but it didn't work. Now he broke. Very nice. Get you here. Stab a stab. You cannot even move anymore. Run them down, of course. Gonna check my map. He got three levels. That's very decent. Absolutely free gold. Ah, because we are in a in an event. I'll take it. So, while we move back, who leveled up? Okay, so you have no hope to become useful. Therefore, you're gonna become what I know as the oh god, please try to be useful for as long as you can build. Which starts with these three, then rotation. Uh, I forgot what from here. Maybe some of the weapons. And assuming they get this far, they can grab all of these. I don't know how this person would survive this long, but you know what? Who am I to judge? At that point, you may want rest as well. And let's leave a freebie for the weapon. And we're gonna. Oh, look at that! Another mod! <laughs> We're gonna call this the 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 trash is a little bit offensive. Trash. Um Hopeless. Beautiful name for a build. Okay. So hopeless, you're gonna start with this, and then you're gonna go for any hit that you can get, any health that you can get, and any melee defense that you can get. What about you, Conrad? Do you have any hope? No, not really. Okay. By the build. Oh, by the way, of course, the, the perk marker is yet another mod. I just love these tiny bits of um, simplicity for using the game. Then we're gonna go for Gustav. Okay. So you have a lot of accuracy. Way more than the average for your class. How can we best exploit this? I think actually this guy wants to use the scythe. Um, because his initiative is garbage. So staying in the back may be the best for him. You're gonna have this. You're probably gonna be able to rotate. You should have this. You should have nine lives. Uh, you should have this. This, obviously, this. Did I miss something? One, two. Oh, I can count here. Nine. I have two more. Um. I 
Could go for quick hands. Uh, you know what? Backstabber I like. Uh, because usually I try to form in such a way that I can make maximum use of Backstabber. I basically clump up a lot. That means anything. We're obviously gonna get this. Uh, what else am I missing? I feel like I'm missing something obvious. I wonder how Headhunter works together with an AOE weapon. Um, I guess this could be a freebie between these two. Let's save it like this. You are going to be a backliner. Yeah. That's the name of the build. Um, but you obviously your level up. Okay, so we're gonna grab this. We're gonna grab this. And I think that any time I don't roll a two on morale, I'm gonna take the plus morale because this is really low. I don't much care about the melee defense. Like eventually he'll be in the back line. He's really not meant for the front lines anyway. So let's go like that. But I have nothing to protect these guys in the back, so they will have to wait a little bit longer. Okay, get back to the place. Look at us go. I'm gonna use speed 3 so that we don't go too insane. And now... We are totally taking this one. This one we can complete without even fighting. And that's probably gonna complete the... This is gonna be great, okay. So, this quest uh, will yield some text, then there may be a fight, but we can choose to retreat from the fight because the quest will be finished. And uh, it will yield high spirits when we are back, which means prices will be cheaper and the faction will probably love us once we finish. So, they all come back. Um, one of them has the relic. They look like they've seen a ghost, where there's actually a lot of um, skeletons. So it's four to six auxiliaries. I want to look at them. It is actually six. So here is the master plan. We run. We run as fast as we can, because these auxiliaries do not break, not stop. They are death incarnate. Uh, I was reading a comment the other day that mentioned that this game brought back a little bit of the glory that a skeleton undead enemy is supposed to present. Oh god, this person is in deep trouble. It's true, I forgot he can barely move. Alright, I'm gonna um, analyze the situation. I may try to... Help. <clears throat> <coughs> ah, speaking is complicated. Ah, so if he gets caught, I may want to help him out, but I'm not really sure. Like, I don't think I can help him out. <coughs> Maybe if I keep distracting all of these, and the rest of the team can focus on the bottom one. Right approximation of that tactic. Go here. Uh, you belong to the bottom group. Uh, you try to attract them top. Go down here. So what will happen? I really don't think he will be able to escape. Maybe if we hide him in the bushes. <laughs> um, gonna keep attracting people by putting them there. Did I get too close? One, two. Nope. Um, person in the bushes. Get here. The aerial. Get up there. 
though three auxiliaries I can probably fight. If these three move up, um, I will observe what my chances are, what my options are. Uh, but in any case, you won't be in the high ground, that's for sure. And you... Eight. You are okay over there. Won't get the high ground yet. You will move back. Wait. Wait. Actually, I put myself in range already. My mistake. Uh, you will wait. And you will move. Just, let's see what they do. Now, because I waited with everyone... Okay. That kinda gives me hope. I can maybe make a... a strategic retreat. Steps. So, you will go there. Here. There. Get as close as you can. Get out of here. Keep moving away from them. This way. It's really good that he went for shields up. Okay. So one, two, three, four. We need to move this away. This won't be able to escape if he decides to go all in though. So you wait. One, two, three, four. One. Wait. 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 You need to move the best you can. Board guy is low. Don't even know why his fatigue is perfect. Okay, so we're gonna put one, two, here, and let's see what happens. That guy got really close, sadly. So for next turn, I want you here. You guys should approach the exit. Hmm. I may have trapped myself at it. Um, certainly move back. Then... Here. 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 Get over there. There's a big chance that either we engage or we lose this guy. That's basically it. So we're gonna wait. Cannot wait though. Can wait. Can wait. Wait. One, two. And then and technically move you up here. I think that's a good idea. Um, if I get engaged this turn, then this is basically the best spot. The fact that three are chasing the guys upstairs is really good for me. One, okay. You have to wait. So what will it be? Am I engaged? I'm still not engaged. But what if I engage? I will, I will die, right? Like, why am I even trying? This is certainly not a battle that I want. The fact that I've divided them in three is actually quite positive. I really gotta think this through. What's the benefit of winning? Good helmets? A bit of XP? Pretty sure a lot of people will die. They don't break from panic. And the guys in the top are already kind of in trouble. Um, okay. We're gonna fall back one more time, I bet. 
go south with everyone who can run. And north over here, of course. Um, yeah, over there. Ah, oh, he closed in. That is such a fast hard move. Well, I think I may may just retreat, and maybe he gets lucky and can run away two times. That's basically it, right? Like everyone else will be safe. We'll just lose one guy. I did say I was gonna take results as they are, and this is one of those cases, right? Like, what are we gonna lose? A shield and a pimp hat? Not that bad. Street. Maybe we get lucky and he escapes over two turns, which is wishful thinking, but counts. Move, 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 move. Okay. Worked one turn. Let's see what happens on the second try. Nope. No escape for Gunbert. But he did well. He tried his best. I know that. And we will get the money to replace him anyway. Not that I should be celebrating like that, but... All the bad things that can happen... Uh, losing a crippled, low-tier guy is not the point. High spirits, as we mentioned. And, ooh, look at that. We even get cultists. Okay. So they will basically be happy about everything. Can we buy... Look at that. Very good prices. Four items. Uh, let's get some tools because they are extremely cheap. Same as ammunition. And the uh, healing salve is sadly not as good. I'm inclined in buying another pitchfork. I would not mind more guys staying safely in the back. At 123, it's quite cheap. Let's see who can we find now. This is an expensive cultist. That's more like it. Ah, it's the armor that he's wearing, right? Do I want a cultist? That is a different question then. Let's see. <laughs> I find it funny that the tryout is always so expensive compared to just hiring them. Do I want any of these people? I do. I, I need more people. Eventually I need to reach 12 anyway. So honestly, Gisel here is probably the same as the other. This is called the follower and this is the occultist. Um, well, to be fair, as names go, occultist is better. Let's go. And what did we get? An absolute complete garbage person. Well done. Way to not be promising. The good thing is we get to close ranks a little bit here. Like this. And uh, we get to put one more good actor safely in the back. I feel like, you know what? I'm gonna do two changes. I guess we'll be okay now we have three cool people in the back two of them can thread a needle how cool is that all right do we need anything else from this it's crazy that we there's a fletchery here and there were no archers but I believe it is time to go south right maybe we need food Some of these and some of that. And I wonder if I should be selling the nacho parts. Um, 
Because honestly, they don't do a lot. At least not at this stage of the game. Especially the brains, I can, you know what? Not even that much money, but whatever. Okay. Ah, we got this. Very good. First ambition has been completed. Uh, and we do have, what, five of these? So honestly, if the ambition for trading comes up, I may just take it. Because now we are in Altenhof, who won't sell us stuff because people have been busy. But they would normally sell cloth roll. What mission do you have? Caravan? Uh, no. Thank you. Sadly not what we want to do with life. I guess I could have checked what people they have, but we're quite, quite low on money. Farmers are really good though. I'm gonna take one. Uh, the farmer stats are very, very decent, especially in fatigue. So they make good two-handed people sometimes. Look at that. Very eager to act. And will be determined and high boost morale at all times. A bit crazy as far as initiatives go. But hey, what? so be it. Uh, he could have rolled more than one star and more than 51. So I guess he's basically average, but honestly above average at our current state. I'll take it. We are getting to the south, my favorite region. What's our salary right now? 80? I guess it's pretty good. We're 10 people. No joke. How many nomads? What's... Uh, so that's 4 to 6 and 2 to 3. Let's see. Oh wow, it's actually maximum enemies. I really like nomad stuff. Can we bring them to something? Maybe that's the best solution. Ooh, a trading caravan. That makes me really happy. Will you engage? No? Is 11 too many trading caravaneers for you? Why engage? If it was the knight, I think I would engage with no issue. But it is not. So well, let's get here and see what we do. Okay, so what do we have here? First trading. Prices are really good, look at that. Uh, 160 gain. Very nice. Then we can buy this and bring it north. I like it. I'm gonna buy three. Maybe think about what we do. So, this place is the arena place, actually. What does the arena want us to do? Three nachos. I'm pretty sure one of them will be a big one. I have to think it over. 610. Do we have people ready to fight nachos? Like it would be you. I have oh, no armors, no nacho fight. Sad, but reality. Uh, terrorizes. I actually like this idea because we can bring them back to the bandits or to these people. Okay, so what is this? Arenas. Uh, trading. You are one millisecond too late for this. Doesn't men. This this one is easy. Yep. So thing that terrorizes us. Where are you? Okay, four hyenas. This is this has the potential to all fit. I need to be very careful with how I do this. Ah, perfect. Look at that. When you see a second banner beyond yours, you know you will be engaging with friends. That's exactly what we wanted to do. Now we will be able to fend off the hyenas with love. Let's mass wait.
let, of course, the AI take the brunt of the attacks. I mean, not like they have taken anything yet. But... Um, you get back here. Did this finish it? I don't trust it, so I'm gonna move back with those. And the cultist. And uh, you will move home. I believe in you. Okay. They still have moves. So... This guy will come here and shoot. I think I want to let that happen. The fact that I felt like he was gonna shoot my guy over here made me really scared, but it all worked out. So you are gonna pass, you are gonna have to walk like crazy, you will be too late for the party, you will not get even close to So get down here, and then you can go here and punch this. Nice. Wait. Ooh, prime opportunity. 63, 53? No, I lost the 55. Of course. That was scary. Okay, so... Is the group of people done? Oh, I will have to wait with this guy anyway. I would be happy if we get one kill though. Certainly won't happen with So get here and attack. That would have been great. Yeah, gotta go. Good attack. So what's the problem with Gash again? There is no problem per se, right? There's no negative side to it. Just costs more stamina. Okay. Very nice. Very nice. Sadly, I think they will have the first attack next turn. Run them down. Maybe we get lucky. Not with you. Oof. So I want to explain how that was insanely dangerous. AI does not care at all if friendly fire would be hitting you. So they could have easily killed some of my top guys with such a shot. Okay, we got nothing, no experience, but the mission is complete. And uh, that means we do get something out of it. We can even now chase the nomads down, assuming they will help us. Or if it becomes night. I'm also okay with that. Did it become night? I don't know. Not night time. This sucks a lot. Let's see how it looks, how they move, when they move. I'm very inclined on fleeing. They don't even have anything cool that I want to grab. So it's just a fight for XP. I don't really feel safe enough to do it. So we're gonna retreat. But before we, I hit retreat, I'm gonna manually move. They do these things. They tempt me into moving forward. No, 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 don't trust. This is one of those moments where you bite the bullet and you accept that you have to retreat. It's the only way to avoid the Alter 4 Clown Fiesta. Ah, 
Uh, the reason I manually move this is because sometimes the retreating AI decides that running into the opponents is the best way to move uh, to, to retreat. And uh, yeah, that makes me angry. Come on! And this is why I wanted nighttime. What were the chances? Just okay, actually, a lot. And yeah, at least, you know what? I'm happy we didn't get any injury. Because this can crack your head easily. Zero care, zero fear by these enemies. And that's the good armor, by the way. And that was just a rock being thrown at me. Okay, I'm ready to retreat now. This is basically as safe as I can be to retreat. And that's why I needed night time. Like that that attack already there really shows how brutal these uh, slingshots can be at the start of the game. Okay, so just to confirm, you are going to be okay. This was a 65 armor. Tome did not care at all. Okay, we got back. Was that another mission? I think so. Is it a package? No. Drive off nomads. I think we can do that, yeah. Where? There. I want to see what we're up against, though. Many is 7 to 10, but it's all melee people. Are you done repairing? Almost, yes. I could take a little bit of camp time. So a tick. We do one more tick. Let's do one more tick. I think that was it. Yeah, I think that's good enough. Let's go. Okay. That's the type of distribution I want to see. Is there anyone extremely dangerous? This guy. This guy is even more dangerous. And uh, what do I mean by dangerous? Basically, at this point of the game, uh, it's the chance to hit that a weapon would grant. And that's how I determine if someone is extra dangerous or not. And spears give plus 20%. An insane number. I'm hating a little bit on the UI bug. Maybe I'll take a break to try to fix that. Um, what am I gonna do? I can put the shield guy here, which means you should go down here. Okay, do I wanna try to punch one of you? Go for you. Just un... Normal attack. No, let's go for the head. Yes. I kinda don't want to put you there, so let's put you here instead. Which sounds worse, but it gives the space for this guy to enter the realm. And puncture is never gonna happen. This. Let's go for this guy. Miss. Let's go here. Miss. Here an attack. Nice. Sadly, this guy is too fast compared to the others, so he won't be able to attack this turn. Let's move him down here. I think he will be more useful in this front line over there. Uh, you will go there. Sadly, cannot defend. We'll go here and try to stun. Very good. Nice V. Then you, up, ah, work, and finally an uh, eighty percent. Very good. Okay. So next up is you, and then the spear. 
So as long as this guy doesn't die, this spear won't get to attack. Actually, he won't get to attack because he moves first. <laughs> That's great. Good stabs. Ow, ow. That was... Someone random. Okay, well, so be it. Um, maybe we get the kill here. Maybe not. He survived. I could move away from him. Like this. I like it. Very good. Let's start attacking. Um, Fan or shield or both? Actually, maybe just wait. He has the shield up now. That's gonna suck a lot. Nice. Uh, hitting morale is very important in humanoid attacks. Uh, combat, sorry. I'm gonna go for this guy. Very good. Uh, same here. Uh, would have been a kill, of course. I'm gonna go for this. If I had gotten the stun, I could have moved away, but there was no luck. Now we can move this final spot here, and you can... I guess we're gonna go for stuns. 40%. It could have happened. Panic would have been great. No panic. No panic. 60. Come on. Okay. Still no panic. Wow. Okay. Death also is better than panic. Alright, so this guy worries me. He will take action in five turns. Okay, a standard is relevant. Good hit. Okay, that all worked out. Uh, what are you gonna do? You can barely punch, so try to tire this person. That kinda worked. And then what are you gonna do? Maybe we get a panic here? I should have pushed him. What am I doing? Uh, let's go for the panic roll. No panic. Panic roll. Panic! And with you, attack. Ah. Mm. I kind of want to move him over here. But I also want to move the shield, so let's, let's clear things out. I'm going to move here and attack. Good. Good job. Good defense. Okay, that kill is done. Let's... Hmm... Thinking of pushing this guy out, but I would need um, stamina to do that, so that's not gonna happen. Who are you again? Just a random. Oh. 50 or 44, let's go with numbers. Did nothing. Try. Okay, so... If I move here, I could attack, but nothing else. I guess that's decent. Go for panic? It's a little bit dangerous, isn't it? Does it matter? No. Did nothing. Uh, go for damage. Woo! That was good damage. <laughs> you will wait. You will wait. Sadly, now we put two very easy targets in front of him, so... Shame. Shame on me. Um, do I want to save Conrad for any particular reason? Because otherwise I can offer him as a sacrifice to the god. The god of wavering. Yeah, this... Was he special? Somehow don't think so. Wait, no, 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 no. Okay, that's wavering... Okay, so he was at 50. Okay, he's certainly not special. That's one star in attack, but... Uh, 50, 36. 
Hmm. If I deal enough body damage, he will reel from it. And the normal attack won't do that. Yeah, let's go with a pierce. Nice pierce. Oh, and we also got the hand. This is a chance everyone lives. Or, Conrad, you gotta say goodbye. I love it when a plan comes together. Okay, so now you wait. Now we start panicking you, probably. Why are you not moving? Here and wait. Here and wait. Don't do anything. Anything. Okay. Now we get to stab you. Or carve you out. Someone did actually die, but I guess I forgot who. <laughs> okay. That was a good battle. We even got a free salt out of it. Five tools is decent. One spear is very nice. Clothes are... Wait, these are 50 clothes. Honestly, I'm impressed. So, let's go back. Um, we replace your shield for a better shield. Same for you. A lot of people have leveled up. Go oh, little by little. Um, this is whom we said was gonna be a potential, right? I, okay, th there's no... Injury on this person, his attack sucks, and his defense is 3, not the worst. So we're gonna, we're gonna go all in trusting this guy. At least he will live as long as he can. Go with that. These are terrible rolls. Oh, shit. I guess you're gonna get ranged defense. I hate grabbing. Okay, how do we build a tank? Get you, nine lives. I don't think I will grab nine lives with this guy, but that's what I would normally get. Ah, uh, you're gonna need this, you're gonna need this, you're gonna need this, you're gonna need this. You're gonna need this, no, obviously. I want... I do have some spots for you. I guess we can get... Brown. I could grab gifted actually. Which for this character may absolutely make sense. Kinda feel like I'm missing something. That's just nine points. Ah oh, yes, yes, yes. That's fine there. Um, I usually don't take Colossus. I know some people, they stand by it all day long. Don't mind Resilient. I guess the choices will be between these two. They certainly don't need quick hands. Um, let's call this the tank bro. Okay, Ralph, you are a hit wonder. And the messages. Sorry. <laughs> oh, that was good. The oh, I found something very funny. So, Ralph, what are we gonna do with you? Are you gonna stay in the front lines, Ralph? You have way too little resolve for this. But yet another backliner? I mean, the answer is why not? I even like this plus four coming out of nowhere here. I don't love it though. I 
think I may have to take morale at all points. Nah, if I keep him in the back, he fine. So maximum fatigue. More AoE slashes. I like that. You are gonna be a backliner melee. Um, you are hopeless. So let's grab this. Be truly hopeless? Yes. I mean, we can grab more health. Grabbing plus one melee feels so bad every time. But yeah, he is hopeless for a reason. Um... This guy, what are we gonna do with him? So that's a clear go. That's a clear go. Should we go for morale? Turn this into a frontliner? Fatigue is complete garbage. Okay, so I'm gonna load the backliner melee. This. And I guess I will see what I do later. But yeah, student, student. Ah, yes. What are you gonna be? This is the guy that could go insane in initiative. Oh, you know what? This is this is our. Uh, Bannerman. Look at the 52. That's just insane. Do I want the initiative anyway? The good thing of a Bannerman... <laughs> Why does he have 11 defense? Is it because of this? Okay, you know what? He's certainly gonna get this. Certainly gonna get this. I think I should get him more health. That will be the only reasonable thing. And sadly, as cool as it is... I mean, I, I could get someone else to become the Bannerman, honestly. We're gonna... Three stars does not mean he's the best bro anyway. I like, he started with really low stats. We rolled an amazing gambler. Gambler is a bad late game background so i shouldn't consider him ruined just because we don't make use of this crazy initiative attack combo let's be reasonable come on you are going to be well actually you want that you are gonna have fortified mind you are gonna have but actually you're gonna have rally. Think that. Still one more free perk. Either use this, patient. I think rotation may be a good idea. Maybe he needs to save himself at some point. Uh, certainly not gonna grab this. I guess we end up with it. Pretty crazy sometimes that the early talents are so good and only a few of the late game talents are game changing. Certainly not gonna be a lone wolf. I may actually choose Fearstorm over Killing Frenzy here. Or over something else. You know what? I'm gonna put it like this. Maybe over Brawny. Because they, they don't really need a lot of fatigue. But he's gonna have a lot of resolve. Which means that when he deals one point of damage, which the banner can do, um, the enemies will probably lower, uh, uh, suffer, uh, you know, this. Okay. I'll consider it though. We're still quite a while away from it. No hurry. 
Still, that was a good fight. We lost one man, but it was within our calculated expenses. This kind of pays for it, if you wanna think of it that way. And now, what are you? Where are you taking? Weinburg, two days to the north. I feel like this is all the way up here. On the bright side, the caravan will pass through every other town. So I don't really mind that part. How about I do... What can I also do? Take advantage of Grab this. Uh, we have some armors, finally, to our people. By armor, I mean this. Who else do we want to save? Of the frontliners, none of them. This, this is basically. Uh, of the backliners. Honestly, you. And get a tiny hat. Uh, but we also want you to be more safe than 20, and you more safe than 10. Good help, Richard. <clears throat> okay. Maybe we should sell this here. It is, after all, an exotic good for them. Now, do we want to pay for some people here? There is a disowned novel for 600. That is an amazing background. He could roll 67 melee. I think I'm just gonna buy this person. That's insane. Uh, the resolve usually of them is pretty bad, but as a backliner, they don't care. What else could we buy? An assassin that would be amazing. But no. And uh, no ranged unit inside. Yeah, I'm gonna take the Ottmar. What about you though? Could become a good archer if I RNG like crazy. I'm not gonna do this. Uh, the sound novels have some fun events, I think, if I remember correctly, so. Uh, but the salaries may be a problem. Basically, gonna be 20% of my salary payment. Am I ready for such a step? Mm. He comes with a good armor, so you know what? I'm gonna consider that we're buying the armor. Because he is very average. Like, he's so average, he may be okay being in the front lines. A 62 attack, of course, is better than anything I have as base stats. But that does not make him good. He's not a god bro potential, and being so bad at this... Hmm. What am I gonna do with... He also started with 8 melee defense. That's literally max roll. Ah, these characters, sometimes they just don't roll well at it was a good try though. 25 the minimum? Yep. Yeah, that's pretty garbage. Um, we need to give him a ranged weapon. So, I'm sorry, Bannerman. I'm actually not that sorry. Not sorry enough to send him to the front lines. Uh, you know what? He can stay in the back line. There. What? There. Have a shield. Okay, can we afford two more freebies? The cheapest things we can get. In fact, that's probably the indebted guys, right? <laughs> Is he costing 70 more because he has a shirt? Is that how we're working? I'm gonna pay for cheap. This is cheap. I want the 12th thing. Okay, what did we get? We got a nothing that's ready to die at any point. Uh, let's get you this and a... I don't know.
Oh, he's even the dayteller, not even this guy. He is blind, but he didn't roll absolute garbage. Okay. Get this, this, and you. Okay. Now we are back to 12, and I should sell these tiny things. And this. Everyone got something to eat. Uh, question. Do you have a taxidermist? Answer. No. So be it. Hire me. And up we go. Hey, the 12th. Look at that caravan speed. Okay, we gotta pause when we're on top of the uh, cities. See if we can get some trading going. That sucks because I hope I click correctly to stop. Um, is it time for the battle standard? Complete eight contracts. I think I'm gonna go with that one. I knew it. I knew that was gonna happen. Ah, uh, what an unlucky coincidence. Doesn't matter. And I wonder if it will be daytime when we run over Krakenvada. And so it's yes. So we have these for 515. Not quite enough. But for 430, that's just 70. Uh, but this we buy gladly. Can I pay salaries? I can pay one salary. Am I afraid of that? A little bit, yeah. Cancel one of these. Let's do that. Just let's just be safe. Okay, off you go. Let's see if I. I think I overreacted. But hey, maybe this place doesn't buy for a good price either. It was 514 that we paid. Uh, that we sold for. I was kinda correct. So how about I return to the south? Buy some food. Get down here. I think I would have loved to cross over here to draw the map a bit more. But so be it. So, back to this place. 514 is a really good price. Thank you very much. Um, let's buy even more tools. Even more food. Wow, this place really loves me. Let's make them love me. Where do you want to go? Time book again? Okay, I have an idea. We're gonna go visit this other place. Maybe when we come back here, there will be new products so that we can buy it and sell it over there. I This is just a guess. So we'll see. They're rebuilding. I think I'm gonna try to do their missions first, or buying and selling over here. So, still no taxidermist. Very brutal. Altenhof, very good. What are you? That way. We are gonna be moving up and down. Still a good idea. Nothing here. Freebie crowns. Appearing people. This. Two star terrorize is a little bit scary. 
it could try to drag them to some other place, wherever they are, if they follow me. But honestly, only for 500 though. Let's take a look at it. What is it going to be? It's gonna be... Sp I was gonna say spiders, and I would have been correct. So nine spiders is actually a fight I can take. Um, mainly because of numbers. We have 12 units. We can deal with nine spiders. Um... Let's do it on the plains. I don't think I want to deal with webnecks in the forest. So that should be good enough. That's a freebie high ground that we got there. Am I gonna send Engelbert to take care of it? I guess so. To be fair, one, two. Or I could put the shield guy there. So let's move you out here. Good idea. Even a better idea. But that means they all get to attack me next turn. I was thinking of putting someone here with shield wall and that someone is him. But he's not really that good anyway. So how about I do this, this, or rather, no, no, this is good. Yeah. Let's see, wait. Um, we'll be going over here. You get up and wait. Get up here and stab. Yatsir was not that important, right? This is an in-depth. Get all the way here and wait. You are shield number two. Get over here. I feel like I made a mistake. But here we are. Here, attack. Go all the way here. That was a mistake, by the way. I should not have gone. 84, 74. Always deal any amount of damage that you can. So let's put this guy then here. And let them maybe try to get in here. I don't know. We'll see what. You waited. Yeah, kinda worked out. Wow, straight forward for an attack. And even gets it. That guy is super dead. Mega ultra dead. By this. Oh, he dodged. Okay, he dodged. Right at the nick of time. Should I try to save him? That is the really interesting question. Because I could go here and try to disarm the web. What's the chance? Uh, I don't know. 46%? Ah, got it. Good 50-50. Okay. It did work. Uh, we attracted someone to sit in this spot. So let's try to stab this person. Not a person. Weapon. Um, low chance. Mm, higher low chance. Did not work. We're gonna try to help or kill. I think the answer is pretty obvious. Go for kill. 65%. Oh, this one hasn't acted yet. Okay, kill. Absolutely 100% correct. You are gonna go for this one. Very good. Here. Nice. Uh, you have to move. Interesting. Or should we try to save? Ah, uh, save. Should we try to... Just remove the grip? Hmm. 
To be fair, that kind of turns him into a tank with taunt, right? Like everyone will be very focused on that. So move here and wait. Let's see what happens. Um, can I stun this? 51 chance. That's a yes. Let's move over here. Uh, can I stun this? Can I stun this? No. You kill. Yes. And you... Okay, you are gonna attack here. Very good. Um... Then you are gonna get down and attack... 68. Very good. A kill. Do I wanna talk to the new spider? Kinda do. Okay. New web, new web, nothing, and maybe we get a kill. Wow. The one HP experience. Wow, the one XP. <laughs> Gosh darn it. Okay. This one is fully healed, so... No hit. That's a good... Uh, let's try to help. Nothing. Can I go here? Why, yes. Very good. This one didn't act yet. Good kill. Very good. Okay. Um, I think a stun here is worth more than trying to disarm the nets. Not working out as I wanted. I could push him away. What are the odds? I could also just try to kill him because he's suffering. 75. Uh, you should liberate yourself. Very good. And you still try to stun? Good try. Okay, so you are taunting. Just go for the stabs. You got nothing. Yeah, that gets you killed. You miss your attacks, you die. That's the lesson. Really, did he die? No more cultists at the party. It. Nice stun. Must be some eggs. That was correct. Let's see if we can either end the battle or just kill whatever comes out of it. Do I care? It is experience. Oh. <laughs> Alright, so we're back to 11, but we have a lot of gossamer to knit ourselves a nice scar scarf. And we can go back to Altenhof. 500 crowns. Very nice. Let's camp for a little bit. Morning. 
can check who is here. Ingolf. I want an Ingolf. But I do want these things. Very nice. And uh, grains. Bread also looks amazing. Super cheap. Did I see a hook that was broken? No. The rest was broken. Do I want more of those? I mean, one more could really come useful. I do have one guy in the back line that's not doing anything. Okay. Now, frontliners. How would you feel about an armor swap like that? The new cultist. Gustav, what do we do for you, my friend? I don't think it's time for nine lives yet. You can go for recall. Oh, we want more of these. More of these. <clears throat> Air things a little bit like this. You are a fake tank, right? Like not a real one. Oh no, hey, look at that, he survived. Very good in depth. I'm very sad we have no ranged bro. So, see if we can go get one. If not, we just grab the mission and drive north. So, killer on the run. Actually, that's it. Oh, that's a bit sad. Quick. Either it indicates the act first in the turn at the battle start, or it indicates the extra initiative thing. Hedler, are you terrible? You are decent, essentially. Einar. It is. Well, he rolled literally minimum. Well done, person. Health also almost minimum. Melee defense minimum. Pretty good, man. You get a knife. You will throw a, a net that we could upgrade if we have a taxidermist anywhere in the world. In the world that we know. Take this caravan that way. Will it be some brigand raiders? So that's four of them. We have daggers all over the place on people that can actually hit things. Six with dagger. Sixty-seven and six. The dagger, and I guess. The... Well, if I remove the dagger from this guy. He won't have anything. So be it. Do I even start daggers? Kind of feel like yes. So, um, explanation. I'm probably gonna get attacked by these brigands and the raiders have a very good chance of having ridiculously good armor for the early game situation we are in. And because we also have, I guess, three or four, no, three is correct, three caravan hands with us, there's a very good chance that we're able to take on this battle with basically straight up going into carving mode, into trying to get the the humans out of their armors. I'm gonna go with this. That's why I also start without the range poke because I think I'm just gonna try to surround them and start carving. Oh, I got excited for absolutely. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. It was a good plan. It was 
actually a really cool plan. But we got disappointed by the... Okay, now this is something I don't love getting attacked by, but I guess we have no choice. Let's make sure... Cannot make sure of anything. I think my people have the right weapons, yes. Um, we can do one mass weight of turn. Orcs are very scary. Do not take ice. So we move back. Maybe we can lure one of them at least. Um, yeah, I don't want any one of my people to be right at the at that position. Because that's going to be prime target for the orcs. And I get it. It's a really tempting position to be in. Here. Um, I don't mind it if it's one of the caravan hands, though. So they are free to go there. Hmm... Go down. I feel like the upside is not strong enough. Don't have sufficiently good people. We would it there. Okay, let's see what happens. Wait. Okay, the first charge is there. Whoa! The fastest stun in the west. Okay, that's an awkward place to be in. That's great. Exactly as we predicted too. So what am I gonna do? I could move here. And wait. Okay, good. So. There's one stun there already. Um, let's find positions for everyone, shall we? You will go here. And shield will you will go here and we'll go here and wait. Good challenge. You will go here. Sadly, I gave up this position for free. I feel really dumb for that. I can get here and double shield wall. That gives me the bonus. Um, you cannot get any closer to attack. Get here and get ready. You can get closer and attack, but after our dagger people approach. I think I should focus all my people on the front line and not here. I think that this place has been solved by the caravan people. So let's go. I'm gonna hide here, like in the corner, and miss. Good job. This guy is mine. Hmm, I don't like that. Maybe just here. Good attack. Nice. I'll take that gladly. Uh, we're gonna let this guy live for a little bit longer. Wait, seventy-five percent? Is that surrounded? Like, he's surrounded by three, he's surrounded by two. But in elevation? Ah, this guy has a shield, I didn't see it. Um, well, as such, that's a bit kinda more scary. Just attack. Wow, we hit the head, that's useless. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna try to push him with him. That is very nice. Yes. Take the hits for me. I don't want to take any hit. That was terrible. I kind of don't want to attract this one. I want him to go to the caravan hand. I think I'm going to go upstairs though. Uh, 
better dagger hit would have been great. Here. That is technically surviving, so well done. That was a tough cool. Okay. Um chance to hit 50 63. Well, we went for the stun, but we didn't get it. So... The end, he didn't attack. Like, there's two caravan hands, and then... How about I just wait? Oh, he got the stun! Oh, thank you very much, caravan hand. That was amazing. I believed in you all along. Okay, Arc Young, die. Very good, thank you for dying. Um, here. Let's see if we get a kill here. Come on. These 1 HPs are killing me. Um, okay, so he's stunned, so he can take this for free. Then we go here, miss. Then we and not really move anywhere. Step forward. Guess you will go for the stun and miss. So, can I get this? Can I get this? Oh, 85, 75 and 85 percent both misses. Wow. Uh, I may want to wait because. If I get him too low, he may get the kill for free. I don't want that. Ah, <laughs> oh, the calculations in the brain. They work. My brain is in working state. Okay, we got that kill too. Now we can get this one here. Very good. Up the head. Do I want to get in there? Well, I mean, he doesn't have the shield. He's gonna get hit. Maybe I throw the net? Is it worth trying to save Magnus? Show me Magnus. Wait, Magnus has a good armor. Does that mean I cared about him? It does. Here, have a net. Have you acted yet? No. Who are you gonna hit? Two chances of caravan hands, one chance of my guy. Also, big chance of breaking. Didn't break. Didn't break. Fuck. That was lucky. Thank you. Get here. And then we wait. He already acted, right? Yeah. Get here and attack. Get here and attack. Get all the way here. Attack, attack. Attack. Guy should not appear anymore. Goodbye. Like this. Like that. Oh, he gets to act before me? Mm, that. Yeah, I lost one kill, I guess. Get you here. Still not triggering the... Breaking point. There we go. Any of these a caravan hand? Yeah, this one. Damn. What are the chances that this guy gets the kill? If I don't get the kill by stabbing. Well, 97, you know what? I got so scared. I was correct in thinking that 97 chance to hit was very good. <laughs> the fact that we almost didn't get it was impressive. Alright, or weapons. At least they will sell for some money. The head splitter is a tier 2 orc weapon. Not that I really want to use it. I don't have the anything right now that can use orc weapons. But I'm happy we got this kill. Did we lose any? 
think we got someone really hurt, but nothing more than that. Ah, less damage inflicted. Okay. Well, I'm sure he'll be good. The price for this contract is not really the tallest. But being well supplied means we may be able to sell some extra goodies. In. I forgot to start repairing stuff. Actually, just that. And then we say sell, 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 sell. We want to sell some of the thread as well. At this point, we don't have a lot of use for it. Um, sell, 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 sell everything. Very good. What are we gonna buy though? What are you buying? This was a good weapon, I would gladly buy that. Why couldn't this one be damaged 40%? Honestly, this build hook is so good. Alright. What else do we have here? Bastard. The fact that we just cannot seem to find any ranged unit is very impressive. Okay. Where to next? Let's break south like we said we would do. So we need to try to find as many tiny contracts as possible. No contracts here. Any new ranged person? Nope. Do I want to go to the corner? Yep. I should try to secure some herbs if they're selling. What is this? No. We're not gonna do this. I, I want to even decline it right away because that mission should disappear. A three star right now is completely out of our league. You know what I should have done? I forgot as soon as I got to the other place. I should have gone hunting for the group of five that we met on the way that kind of ran away from us. I'm gonna give it one whirl. If you find it good, if not, we just. Careful here. Okay, so we found... Actually, we found what we were looking for. Did they go inside the camp? No. So what is in here? In here is a non-killable thing. It's great for the future us, but certainly present us has no chance against this. Yeah, I, I suspected this. Sometimes when you run close to camps that are really good, they throw units at you. And this... Don't know if we can deal with this. Already 8-8. Eight, eight. Maybe with great positioning. Maybe, maybe. I don't know what happened there. Okay, so... How do I feel about this? You know what? I think I can do it if I agree to kill some of the, of the good enemies. Which is a shame, but may have to get done. And then we will... Grab nine lives. A bit of more art. And we'll grab nine lives. Ah, uh, maybe 45 mine would have been great. I need to remember that this is my banner man. I mean, nine lives is also. Let's do this. Let's see how it goes. Maybe we even find the other group still. There's a pike. That pike has to die as fast as possible. Um, honestly, I think I should fall back. That is just such a good engagement place compared to my current one. Uh, 
They're all arcing in to grab me uh, from the bottom, which I certainly don't. Here. I wonder if I should send someone on a journey from which they may not come back. Uh, just to try to split the enemies. Splitting them will be really useful. see what happens. Anyone following bottom? You're fine over there. Here. There. Shy Lily. Now I kinda wish I had these two guys up there as well. I guess you can move here. See what they do. There's someone here, let's not forget. They have a big axe still. So. Okay, that's kind of pretty good for engagement. Big axe cannot come in. Get you here. I... I feel like putting my shield. Maybe it will work good enough for next turn. You are kind of important, right? Try to survive, please. I'll, I'll make sure to put enough people around. More important, Gustav. So you're fine. Uh, the cool thing is, if I retreat with this guy, they won't even be able to reach me right now. I'm gonna move. Really, you are kinda okay then. I kinda like this. If it makes anyone go in here, that's amazing. Us. Back to here. Yeah, I like that. Um, and then we. You know what? We have the stamina and the disposable. Um, is it okay for you to go down here? Yes. You can. Should I even move with this guy? I feel like he's good bait. Okay, we wait. Eight. Eight. Okay, so someone moved in, that means everyone will move in now. Wait. They're all moving in down here. Wait. That partially sucks, but it did split them in crazy ways. It didn't split them that much, but it did split. So this guy has to die. Okay. Here. I should not have moved. And this has to be turned on. Okay, so
gonna move this guy over here. Nice. Then you can engage. Here. Guy. I don't mind if I break that armor. No big. Uh, dagger, what are you gonna do? I think we should start cheap. So that I can use the cool attacks later. I wish you had changed the order. Then I could have moved here. Back with one, two. I move back with this guy then. Uh, they won't be able to read. Enough for Very good. Nice attack. Let's not move. Very good. Okay. The axe was one of the most dangerous. Could have easily one shot multiple of our characters. Um, do I want to move Engelbert? Do we care about Engelbert? The answer is no, so yes we move. And all of you are thugs, right? Yeah. So if you die, you make your friends unhappy. Also, good stuff. Good kills. Okay, so these are the armors we want. These has to die. Okay, that worked. Wait. Oh, he moved forward, great. Uh, we need to lock this guy in. So turned on, turned on. I can kind of force this guy to go to the low ground. No, I cannot. But I mean, forcing would have been quite lucky. Okay, so I think I want you... Maybe just change to dagger. Prepare for the future. Change to dagger. Here and whomever goes here is very likely to die. And also we still need to go to the So I'm gonna bring you up here and then we'll see how I continue. Um you will have to stay away from this. Actually, we said I should attack. If I go down here, I'm gonna get killed by literally everyone. The only question is if this guy comes before or after this guy in the turn order. That's the biggest danger. If he... Wait, Adelbert, do you have already nine, nine lives? You do not. So I should not... Wait. That's here. Okay. So yes, I can actually move Adalbert forward. And Einar the Quick, are you important in any way? No. So you could just provide sacrificial opportunity. Mm. More surround bonus, maybe? Like he's he's just gonna kill me immediately. They have good positions. Moving around will do nothing here. One, two. I could just go for it. Then this guy will have a free reign. At least he will be distracted. Yes! That was a good attack. Sadly, we hit the head. That's actually not so lucky, but I will take it. 
Now what do we do? I think I need to wait with this. He's in a prime position to carve this guy next turn. Make a bit of room. Then we move you here and let's hope for an 81. Nice hit. Then you can move here. Careful if you so carvers. This is gonna be taken care of by the others. So let's start moving. Wait. Good move. Can we get the kill? That would be crazy. Ooh. 40s? Ooh, that was the quickest kill ever. Damn. Well, that was the call. You know. That guy. The 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 in that pit. There we go. So I can move here and stab this. This has already acted and maybe we get to kill that. Please tell me that you dropped the weapon. Oh, yes! That's really all that mattered. If we can carve some more uh, armors, that would be amazing. But the pike, that one makes the difference. Okay. Should I split the carving teams or should I just try my best? On one and then move to the other. I think I like that idea the most. So how can I do this best? Carve here, carve from here. I'm actually thinking of splitting. I do have enough people to carve everyone. Or do I? Actually, I don't have enough daggers to carve everyone. I'm gonna wait with you, what happens. Ah, uh, you don't have a dagger either. So actually... Um, actually... I think I'm gonna go down here. That may get me killed in one hit. Maybe you supply help over here. Everyone is so far away, I need more people. Um, actually, who can even carve at this point? No one. How about I don't carve yet? Well, actually, I carve over here more. Have a dagger? Bug? Yes. So, Ralph is the only one carving here right now. I will get Engelbert next turn, but it's not there yet. And that means... But I do think this is a better idea. Do I want to really get there just for the sake of proximity? I think the answer is yes. That was a good idea. Uh, you need a new weapon. Place. You cannot do much. Actually, just stamina. That was a free kill. That's very good. Should I try even at 25? I feel like I should. 42, I will try. Oh, the hand. Getting in the hand is really good. Okay, so now you can get up here. More fear, very good. And then maybe even more fear. No more fear. Wait. Arf, arf. Nothing. Ah. Uh, Hurt. Someone will die. Yeah. How this goes. I would have liked a hit there. Oh, the dagger is gone. That sucks a lot. I 
I can go for a stun. I feel okay enough for that. Up and down. Okay, this guy is going faster than this guy. Um, do I want to? Do I want to stab him? Actually, spear stab could be good because of the helmet being missing. No, oh, that didn't work. Can I break the shield? Maybe that's a good idea. Then you sadly nothing. Okay, more carving. 28%. Hmm. Could break the shield though. But one success, and he's breaking. There we go. Just as predicted. Um, I kinda want to surround here, but not from the low ground. Rambert is important. He does have nine lives, though. He acts in eight turns. Who goes first? Seven. One. Okay, that's... Probably gonna work out in a go there. Wait. Go down here. Wow, this person is not even he is wavering. Uh let's remove the shield. Actually, no, you know what? That's basically it for him. Uh let's move here for a full surround. Anik is setting in, very good. This and wait. Arfs. Nothing. Nice. Oh, he's already in panic mode. Very good. Okay, wait. Beautiful. Uh, let's do this. And then I'm gonna remove the weapon because I don't want to counter his escape attempt with a good hit. <laughs> that was amazing so what happened here is he tried to run away and luckily alfred who was the one to stop him hit him in the head which means no armor damage my favorite words okay can i carve you now still no carve not you i should not have stopped with him uh, let's move you here. So then the last one will be here and 60. Nope. I guess I could try to punch him. Or miss. And then. Still not. I mean, he will bleed out or I will kill him. Either or. Carving. 70%. There we go. Conrad lives with a weak heart. I don't think we care, but sure. I live. Seven levels. Very tasty. We got the axe. We got a helmet. We got one of the armors. Two of the armors. Three of the armors. And an amazing bike. Bike. It's a Actually, yes, it is a tier 3 polar. That is how ridiculous it is. Uh, the amount of armor damage it deals. 20 times better than what we had. Uh, or here. I'm gonna get it though. Right up. It's the highest damage. So 63 gets the second this weapon, then 63, then 63. Okay. Now, you can move here. Not have anything. What do we want to do with you, Otmar? You do kind of suck a lot. 
basic make a normal brawl out of you. Backliner melee applies to everyone. Okay, so front lines. Are you a cheap bro? Was not, <clears throat> not the indebted, the one who died. He's still here. Unless I have two. I guess that's also possible. Still, the 24 morale makes this person certainly not usable. No matter how much I try to pump it, also, he rolled terrible. Uh, so let's go somewhere else. Let's go... I mean, I use whatever. Hey, look at that. Someone made it to three. Slow. Okay, what are we gonna do? This. This. Usually on the gifted level, you need to try to grab things without stars. I mean, I always grab melee, of course. That was a good leveling session. Kinda deserve clothes. So, we're gonna defend to the most. Yeah, that's correct. I could move him to the back line too. I do like having an extensive front line though. Do not mind that. This, then this. Those are some very bad rolls. I guess we'll get you. Range defense, and I hate grabbing it. Um, twelve. Time for your nine lives. They are the quick. You are terrible. Not much we can do. Alfred, you made it to three. Congratulations. Gift. Right. So here's the fun thing. Sadly, many is a lot. Damn it. Still too many. Alright, we're gonna chase the other group. Still be around here. The group with five. They just die here. Ah! That's correct to stay away from them. Do I want to go grab these people? Just nine humanoids random and what, three archers? Don't think I want to risk that. Okay. So we did a good exploration round. I got to buy something at the port town, sadly. How is our stash doing? We have more armors. Start protecting the backline. That's gonna go on you. 90, 80, 65, 50. And then the 50 goes on to you. And I deserve it. Lift some, some stuff. Ooh, we have a flail. Maybe you need the flail. Basically a dagger in certain situations. Gets the sword. How about 62? Our friend 60. 
Uh, do you deserve a shield? And want a shield? Would you prefer to have the head splitter? A lot more damage. For a bit more stamina. A lot more damage. I mean, as long as he doesn't have armor, then he has the stamina. Actually. Okay, we have someone else with no clothes. Yes. Okay, where are we? Over there. Let's get down back to Nieveland. What a crazy first episode. Only day 12. Can I make it in daytime? Yes, I actually can. Sadly, this is really expensive. I wanted some medical supplies, but that is quite the price. Do I want to sell stuff here? Why not? I'm not gonna be using that. Just not worth the effort. I could sell this. The axe is nice, I'm gonna keep it. That can go. We have an extra helmet. Oh, without the helmet. Thank you. You deserve it. I've earned it. I would love one ranged person. There was no contract renewed. We just go to Krakenbader. Still no ranged. Something terrorizing for one star. Yeah, that's up my alley. And let's get the peddler. He's bad. I don't want to get. Rather not get anyone. Then pay for nothing. Six direwolves is the number of direwolves. That is no joke at all. That is not a one star, but you know what? Six direwolves is pretty good. For their items. So let's go. See how it goes. Wow, that was a brave direwolf. Absolutely. Okay. I would love to be able to move back, honestly. So the question is, can you kill? Not bad. Kill? Come on. Hmm. Wait. Kill? Oh, come on. That, I counted on you. Okay, that's Nice, we move back. You. Maybe I can put the tiny guys on the high ground here. That will be decent. Uh, I want to avoid double or triple attack. I think I can get it. I'm going to put you here. Wait, I love going for that here there hey, what's up ow ow oh that worked oh that made me so happy oh the plan worked mostly as I drew it up this is a frenzied dire wolf though 
This is not a one star mission, by the way. That's super illegal of them to call it one star. Um, yeah, let's start punching this. And you. Like, my brain says that I should be going for the Frenzied. But if I don't kill it, then it's two dire wolves having full rounds of attacks. That is a lot of dire wolves. Damn it. That I needed to hit. Like, not hitting anything was literally the worst option. You should wait. You should. This? Close enough. I'm happy to go for headshots. Ooh. Nice. That was really useful. Should I repel you? 61, 66. Same chance to hit. If I repel, I won't be able to attack. That's the part that sucks. Let's try to kill this. Okay. Hate to say. So, Axe. Would you like to get over here and try to hit this thing? Probably would, but you should wait until we confirm this kill. Or we don't. 38, 48. Heals up. Spear wall. Yeah, spear wall is correct. Cannot move. You can attack. Now, what do I do? I think trying to confirm the kill makes the most sense here. Or the panic. Yeah, that's already great. Kill as an extra, I'll take it. Yes! That was really good. Ah. Now you all will die. Need to get this first. Wait. Stab. Beautiful. Then you can attack this. 72. Ah, oh, perfect. So this is the only one remaining, basically. How are we gonna deal with that? Well... This is a prime position, so don't go there. Go here instead. And sadly, this guy cannot get there in time. Unless I go here? He does have enough armor and... You know what? We did it. That was it. You can move here. You can close down. You can get here and whack. Bump. Nothing, nothing. Get here. Of course, run them down. Zero pelts so far. God damn it. I should actually give the kills only to people that can make good use of it. Not you. This you. Seventy percent, eighty percent. Good eighty. Good job. All right. How many pets? Ooh. Sadly, two is not enough for anything. Damn. Three would have been great. But hey, I'll take it. Very nice. That means dire wolves may exist in this area, which is already very, very good. Oh, the payment was really low. Get out of the niceness of my heart. Um, yeah, let's buy this all out. And the tool. <laughs> These medical supplies are even cheaper than the ones in the other place. Uh, do I need more food? No, I just got an amount of food. It will expire soon. 
so cheap here. Do I need to sell anything? I would love to find one uh, one range unit, yes. Uh, no, one. Um, I forgot how to speak. Taxidermist! Alright. There is no mission in Altenhof. That means we're gonna go to the south. However, I think I'm gonna, gonna start the journey just for the sake of knowing what I was trying to do. I am going to take a break because this has been a great starting run. A uh, good first episode. And we don't want to taint it with more failures or deaths. So. Thank you all very much for watching and I will see you the next one.